Hard to believe it's been more than 20 years since the final episode of Full House aired. Well, this week, the world's been busy watching or catching up with the Tanners and their extended family, including the beloved Uncle Jesse on the Netflix reboot, Fuller House. Take a look. Seth, you know, for your first aunt talk, I think you crushed it. I did, didn't I? Well, you better. I gave you like a thousand uncle talks, except for you forgot two very important words. Have mercy. <laughs> no. How rude. <laughs> John Stamos, good morning. Welcome good back. Good morning, Matt. Make a promise. Let's not get physical with each other. That's this right. Time, you slapped right? me last time. I have a headache, so I don't <laughs> want to get physical. Well, it's good to have you here. You were Thank here you. last time when this whole word of Fuller House just leaked. That's right. And you were yeah. saying you, you were encouraged by the initial reaction, mm -hmm. hoping it would last till the show came out. Wow. I know. It's, uh, I was nervous. I mean, we did the shows, and they were really sweet and cute, and, uh, but I was worried I, because the anticipation really built up you know, from the time we finished it till the time it aired, but I think people are happy with it. It's trending everywhere, it's so and sweet. it's already renewed for a second season. It's that doesn't great. happen every day. I know. I'm very grateful. It's, you know, it's, com it's comfort for us. I was thinking about this morning. I think it really makes people feel comfortable seeing that house and the characters. Like you, Matt, you're comfort food. You oh, know? that's nice. Like I mean, a this, comfortable pair of slippers? Well, yeah. You're sort of a slipper kind of guy. It's a time stamp for a lot of people, right. the original show. Mm -hmm. What was your timestamp show? What show <clears throat> did you watch as a young man that kind of always takes you back to that period? Like Happy Days, Laverne and Shirley. I loved those shows. I was on, you know, I did General Hospital first, but I wanted to be on those type of sitcoms. And then here I was on Fuller House. You said Full something House. recently. You said, I'm Uncle Jesse. I'm everyone's uncle. But you also said that you spent a lot of time in your career after the show trying to shed Uncle Jesse, what made you decide it was okay to embrace him again? Well, time has passed. You know, um, when I finished Full House, I remember originally the first guy I called was Jack Klugman, who was my mentor. I did a show with him before Full House, and he said, "Go to the theater." So I came out here and did, you know, quite a few Broadway shows, and I felt like I'm, I'm an actor now. And and I, you know, this again, like comfort food. People love it so much. It means so much to them that. I, I'm, I'm, I'm lucky that, that I can make people happy with that, I guess. I, I want to apologize in advance because this next question is exactly the same question I asked you last time you were here. Uh -huh. I know you wanted the Olsen twins to come on in season one. Didn't happen right. for one reason or another. Is it still a viable possibility? For sure, yeah. They're totally welcome. Um, I was going to see Ash last night and, and beg her to be on the show. <laughs> we would love to have him. I know everybody would love to see him, and I, I have a good feeling about it. A few other things. You know, it, it's a bit of an embarrassment of riches for you, and it's not nice, but in addition to this, you've got another show, uh, Grandfathered, yes. that's going strong. Do you ever stop and think, wow, there are a lot of actors out there who never get the chance for one of these, Yes. and I've got all these opportunities? Every day. I'm so grateful. I'm really living in a period of, of gratefulness. I mean, my life has, has honestly never been better, and I just wake up every day, and, and I'm very thankful. And settle one thing for me. The yes, Beach Boys, Matt. are they still out there touring? And are you still playing with them from time to time? Yes, yeah. In fact, I just we were just in Florida last week. I came here for a couple of days to promote Fuller House. And tomorrow night I'm in Austin with the Beach Boys. They are so good. They're doing 175 shows this year. And they are, sound better than I've ever heard them sound. It's official. I want to trade lives with you. <laughs> I know, lucky. really, you've got every... And by the way, my big fat Greek wedding, too. Yeah, that's coming out. Coming yeah. out as well. Good for you. Thank good you, Matt. Good for you. Thank it's you always much. nice to have you here, John. Thank you. And again, Fuller House is now streaming on Netflix. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.